everyone, Rachel here from Get Feedback. Welcome to another episode of Simplifying CX. If you're new to our channel, welcome. Our videos are here to provide you with straightforward answers to the biggest CX challenges. If that sounds relevant to you, don't forget to subscribe. Today, I'm going to go over shopping cart abandonment and shopping cart abandonment rate, which is one of the most important metrics for e-commerce brands to track. First, I'll define shopping cart abandonment and talk about why it's important. Then I'll discuss how to measure it using the CAR metric. The term shopping cart abandonment refers to when a prospective customer starts the checkout process for an online order, but drops out before completing the purchase. In other words, when there is an item in an online shopping cart that never makes it through the transaction, it's considered to be abandoned by the shopper. There are many reasons shoppers might be abandoning their cart on your website or application, but before you delve into the possible issues, it's important to know how to measure your cart abandonment rate, also known as CAR, to gauge your current situation. Knowing your cart abandonment rate can help you identify if there are hidden challenges on the path to purchase. If your CAR goes up, that's an indication that something's going wrong. So how do you measure CAR? To calculate your CAR, divide the total number of completed purchases by the total number of created shopping carts. Subtract the result from one and then multiply by 100 to get the percentage. For example, if there are 70 complete purchases and 400 shopping carts created total, the cart abandonment rate would equal 82 and a half. A high cart abandonment rate is a sign that somewhere across the customer journey, there is at least one poor experience or broken funnel. You can identify the poor experience or broken funnel by collecting feedback across your site via in-the-moment surveys, capturing customer loyalty metrics like CSAT, CES, MPS, as well as qualitative responses from your customers. These surveys help you dig deeper to identify and fix existing issues in the customer experience. We've covered these types of surveys in previous Simplifying CX episodes, so check out our playlist for more information. Once you've calculated your cart abandonment rate, continue tracking this metric to see if you're improving or where you might need to make changes in the future. For more on shopping cart abandonment and how to improve your cart abandonment rate, click on the description section of this video. The guide takes a deep dive into the common reasons shoppers abandon their cart and how you can overcome them. Also, if there's a topic you'd like us to cover, be sure to leave it in the comment section. And subscribe now to see more videos that simplify CX. Until next time.